John and James are having dinner after work. John decides that James is a close enough friend that he can tell him about his secret relationship with Rachel and openly talk about his feelings for her. John knows that it's unlawful and against the company's new code of ethics for him and Rachel to have any type of romantic relationship, but he hopes that his relationship with James will trump the rule of notifying Jenny, the head of human resources, of any infractions. While James is driving home from dinner with John, he is really struggling with knowing for sure that John and Rachel are dating. He values his friendship with John, but his work is very important to him. James knows he too could be in trouble if Human Resources finds out about the relationship between John and Rachel and that he knew about it and did not notify HR. James is, not, James is home in bed with his wife, Sarah. He tells her about dinner and what John told him. Sarah is in shock that John would break such a rule, seeing as he was one of the key managers implementing the new rule. He tells James that he has to do the right thing and tell HR about the relationship. She also tells him that he can't risk his job and their livelihood over this situation. James is on his way to work. Knowing that he has to speak with Jenny about John and Sarah, he is nervous and uneasy about the situation. He goes over in his head how he will go about the talk with Jenny and how John will take it when he finds out that James told HR about the situation. James is in Jenny's office and begins to tell her about John and Rachel. She is in shock too, like Sarah was. She assures James that HR will take care of the situation, his name will not be named when approaching James about what happened, and also that both John and Rachel will receive warnings and not be immediately fired for the infraction.